Hey guys, it's Toy Tester Tom, and today we have two more rare Monster Jam trucks. These are trucks that came out in 2004. Long time ago, that's 13 years. Some of you guys may not have even been born yet, and I was a little bit younger, I must say, too. But these are pretty cool, and I hope you have them in your collection. And if not, see if you can find them, because they're pretty cool looking trucks. We have Iron Warrior. Look how they show all these old trucks. Some will know, like the Gravedigger, of course. But look at some of these. Great Bite, Black Stallion, Jurassic Attack, Max D, Ninja Blade. We know some of those, right? We, a lot of these we know, but maybe there's some that you've not seen. Super Truck, Eradicator, Pure Adrenaline. There's some pretty cool looking trucks. 5-0, Shucker, Expelled. Our other one today is Rap Attack. Another cool looking truck. And again, it shows you all those same ones. Same kind of box. Look at that cool. And it's because it came out the same year. So they were packaged pretty similar. Well, no time like the present. Let's open these guys up and learn a little bit more about each truck. Now right off the bat, you can see they're both standard looking pickup trucks. We like those, it's pretty cool, because that really means a monster truck. Now don't get me wrong, I love these new modified trucks, where you got Max D, Iron Man, Spider-Man, there's so many different ones that are NEA Police, Doomsday, come on, El Toro Loco, there's so many really cool things, Pirate's Curse, come on. You know what I'm talking about, really cool looking modified bodies, but these pickup trucks are pretty awesome. They just look really good. They look like a pickup truck you'd see on the street, but they're lifted, so it seems more real, especially when you're there. You're standing about this tall, like maybe to my first knuckle. You're standing there and you're going, holy moly, look at the size of this. Now this is Rap Attack. Pretty cool. Black tires, silver rims, green underbody, and then we got this cool body. Got the Hot Wheels and Monster Jam logo, of course, but the Rap Attack, and he's got the red, white, and blue, Star Spangled Banner, American Flag. And you Americans, you must be proud of that because it's pretty special. Dark blue besides that. Even like the font and the coloring in the font, that's pretty cool. That's a Rap Attack truck, pretty amazing. And then we have Iron Warrior, another pickup truck too. Kind of a charcoal kind of color. And we got Iron Warrior. Nice font too, I think. We've got kind of a gray metallic undercarriage. We got our silver rims. Got a cool logo on the front. Look, it's like a skull. That's amazing. Iron Warrior and Iron Warrior. Great. Now, let's start with Rap Attack. What do we know about this guy? Rap Attack's a Chevy Silverado monster truck and it's driven by David Rapich out of Dayton, Ohio. He started in 1998 and he's competed all across Canada and the US. Rap Attack is best known for its creative and colorful schemes. Beautiful colors, don't you think? Pretty amazing. Now while all monster trucks are usually pretty loud, Rap Attack is known as one of the loudest trucks on the circuit. Wow, that's pretty cool, eh? Lots of history with these trucks. Pretty fun. So that's our Rap Attack. Now we have Iron Warrior. What do we know about Iron Warrior? Iron Warrior is a Ford F-150 monster truck and it's owned by Vader's Motorsports. They also debuted in 1998 and it was driven by Glenn Bowlin out of Florida. And he owned Iron Warrior until 2004 and then Mike Vader's bought the truck. The first Iron Truck became the first straight jacket and then they built a new Iron Warrior. There have been several drivers and they've all done pretty well including Matt Cody, Trey Myers, and Mike Faders. Pretty amazing too, gotta say. Iron Warrior, awesome truck. All right, as long as we have them, we may as well smash them up a bit, don't you think? Oh yeah. Let's try three smashes. We've got Iron Warrior, Rap Attack. 
Oh, both wiped out. Look at that. Spinorama with wrap attack. But unfortunately, Iron Warrior went down too. Let's go to the other side. So I'd say that was a tie. Oh, look at that. That was amazing. He did a wheelie spin. That was pretty cool. I bet if I threw that a hundred more times, you'd never make that happen. So we're gonna give that round to Iron Warrior, but for style, freestyle, we'll give that to Rap Attack. One more time. Oh, a tie again, smashing up. So all in all, I'm gonna call it two winners. Iron Warrior won the smash and crash, but Rap Attack won the freestyle with his wheelie spin. Quite amazing. Well, there you have it, guys. There we got two Monster Jam trucks, rare trucks from 2004 with Iron Warrior and Rap Attack. Two great trucks, lots of cool information, and a little bit of smashing and crashing. So thanks for joining me today, guys. And we gotta thank Hot Wheels and Monster Jam, because they make these trucks. We love them, we collect them, and they're so much fun. So thanks again for watching, guys. And hey, don't forget to subscribe, because we're building a really cool channel here with the Toy Tester Tom Nation. And speaking of the Toy Tester Tom Nation, we're expanding with Triple T, Silly Surprise Eggs, and Little Tom's Nursery Rhymes and Kids Songs. The link's just down below, so go check them out, because I've got lots of new content coming up on both channels. Really starting to take off, so I'd really like your support. Spread the word. Toy Tester Tom Nation is growing, and it's here to stay. So thanks a lot for watching, guys, and we look forward to more great toy testing and lots more Monster Jam trucks on Toy Tester Tom. Talk to you soon.